Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the limited edition Dum Dums. These are holiday pops, and I know these were out last year, and uh, I guess we just never bought them. I mean, I remember seeing them. Um, I thought we did buy them, but, but well, we <laughs> actually but we didn't buy them. And what's cool about them is there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight flavors, and it says that there's a mystery flavor. So, I don't know if the mystery is one of those flavors or. Well, that it. wouldn't be a mystery though, would it? No. So, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, two pops are 50 calories. Uh, it, uh, they're made in the USA in Bryan, Ohio, and Mark and Heidi sent us these. And so thank you, Mark and Heidi. I did not, when they sent these to me, I didn't even know if we were going to review them or not, honestly, because it's very hard to review suckers. And I still don't know how this is going to go, to be honest. So... You know, I may have to add in some music or something fun if it takes us a while, or I don't know if we're gonna just take a bite. Oh. Wow, I'll be Got spent it. for the day after that. <laughs> I just dumped those out early. I'm going to. Okay. Yeah, I I'm just don't know pull. how this is gonna go. Now I wish Andrew was here with us, because Andrew likes to sort. Okay. Let's go through. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And, and then the miss and so that would make up for the mystery. So we are going to be sharing one. <coughs> yep. We're we're gonna try not to share because I know I'll get comments that that grosses people out, even though we're married, and to be honest, I let Guido look after my suckers. We just do. You do. You've done it I before. Used to. I know. Um, <laughs> He's gotten too old and crusty. <laughs> so, I don't think it's gross. We're all family around here, but we won't do it for you. Let's go ahead then and try, and try the this one. This is the Mary Cherry. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Mary Cherry. Mary Cherry. So, do you want, do you want me to take a bite out of it? So we Whatever. Can... As long as you can get a taste for it, it's all that matters. I probably will not bite it up. Mm. That's really good. It tastes like a Hall's cough drop. You think? Well, I see where you're saying with that. No, cherry cough drop. It doesn't have that cough droppy medicine flavor, but it does have that cherry flavor. Mm. It's good. It's a really good flavor. Fears we only got one of those. I know. <laughs> one. And we'll get like 10 of something that, that's just okay. That's okay because we do plan on sharing these um, with Gavin. And we ought to probably keep some here because Amelia, when she gets upset, if you just stick something in her mouth, it's all good. That's a good cherry. Okay. Good cherry. You want to do sugar um, plum next and work our way across? Which one is that one? Oh, that one? Okay. We're not going to share anymore. That's a good flavor. Mm-hmm. It's, it it's very light. I guess it has a plummy type flavor, but it's light. It's a light flavor. I have a really hard time just sucking on something without biting a little bit. Well, I just don't want all that sucker in my teeth. No, no. I like, um, what's the kind with the gum? Charms. Blow pops. A blow pop. Because you have that hard outer shell and you can kind of crunch it just a little bit with your teeth on every side. And then you can like suck the sugar off of it. I have a method. She makes things so complicated. I don't make things complicated. That's good. The plum's good. It's just very, very light. It is a lot of chocolate to next. Why is chocolate next? Because it's not. Oh, you're going by the I'm order on by, the bag. I'm just going across. I thought he was going on order on the table. Oh, here. I'm just going by the bag. Okay, this one's hot, hot chocolate. Good chocolate. Mm-hmm. 
It's weird. It's always been weird to me having chocolate in a sucker form. Mm -hmm. Is it you? A little bit, but I like the Tootsie Roll Pop. So. Mm -hmm. And those are my favorite ones, the chocolate ones. That's kind of what that, that mm -hmm. reminds, reminds me of. Yeah, of a tootsie it's roll. a Tootsie Roll. Mm -hmm. That one's good, and it has a, a little bit of that um, like a marshmallow -y kind of chocolate flavor. Yeah, if you like a Tootsie Roll, you would like that hot chocolate. Yeah, I think good. that's a good hot chocolate flavor. I really do. Okay. I mean, only got two. Sugar cookie, only two. So Master Gavin won't be getting one of these. These are probably the best ones. <laughs> that's so good. It's like vanilla. That is so good. That's vanilla, yeah. It's like a vanilla cream almost. That is so good. Can you believe we only got two? Mm -hmm. The best ones you always want to get. Just a couple of. Mmm. I love that. To me, that is like a pure vanilla candy. Mm -hmm. yeah. I would like this those in like a mint form, like a hard candy form, almost like a butterscotchy like type. A, like a, yeah, it is kind of butterscotchy. It's, yeah, it oh. reminds you of a butterscotch. That'd vanilla. be good in like a lifesaver or something. Yeah. You could suck on it. It does remind you of a butterscotch, though. I know that sounds weird, but a vanilla slash butterscotch. Okay, now we have gingerbread. Yeah, that, that flavor would be really good in like a lifesaver where you could pop it in your mm -hmm. mouth and just, just uh, suck on it for a little while without having to stick. Wow. The ginger is so strong. That's pretty strong. Very, very strong ginger. Maybe a little too strong. If you like ginger though. If you like ginger, you would like this. I don't know. Gavin might like this. The more you suck on it, the more you you get used to the flavor. Yeah, it's not as strong. Mm -hmm. It's not bad. Not my favorite, but like I said, okay. you get used to the flavor. Um, I don't. I don't know if Gavin will like that one or not because I don't know if that's a kid's. I don't know. We'll just have to say apple cider. <coughs> There's a hot chocolate. Is this a apple cider? Mm -hmm. Hmm. That's, that reminds me of apple cider. Trying to get the flavor. It's very light. It's a very, very light apple flavor. But it tastes like a crisp, not like, like a green apple, like a tart apple, but more like a, just a sweet apple. Mm -hmm. It just tastes like a regular apple. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's good, but it's super, super light flavor. Yeah, it's definitely not your green apple. It's just a regular apple flavor. It doesn't remind me of apple cider. To me, that's just regular apple. Like There's apple. nothing wrong with it at all. Now it's, the next one. It's green apple. Green apple Grinch? Green apple Grinch. You're a mean one. Now that one does have the tartness of a green apple. Mm-hmm. You immediately get it. Mm -hmm. And like the apple cider, I had to suck on for a minute to really get that flavor. This, it immediately mm -hmm. hits your mouth. I was gonna still light flavor though. It's not super strong. I mean, it's there, but it's not like, it's not like the vanilla one or the sugar plum or one of those. It's not mm. that strong. That's a good green apple though. That is good. I like it because it's not that tart. Polar Punch, the blue one. Got this. Yeah, the blue one. Mm. It's a little floral-y. Is that a word? Floral-y? Floral? It's floral. Floral-y. <laughs> that reminds me of just um, like a fruit punch. To northerner, northerners, it would be floral. Once you get to the south, you can add more to it. Floral, uh, florally. <laughs> That's good. I like mm -hmm. that. I like that flavor. Mm -hmm. It's not tropical punch though. Mm -hmm. I thought maybe it would be like tropical punch, and they were just calling it polar punch, but it's not. I mean, these 
these aren't like the regular ones that they've just changed the name. They've literally changed, they're what they say they are. Of course, cherry's the cherry, and yeah. the green apple's green apple, but everything else, it's, it, they really are different. All right, now I wonder if the mysteries are going to be completely random mysteries, or if they're going to be like all the same I bet flavor. all the same. I'm guessing, well, yours looks like root Mine's beer. cracked. Mine's blue. Oh, so they're different. Well, you all need to know that. So, I bet you this is the same thing as a sugar plum or whatever, the, or the polar punch. Gingerbread. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is polar punch. So basically, they've just taken the same suckers and wrapped them in a, you don't know what you're going to You don't get. know which flavor out of these, this bag you're going to get. They haven't given you a new flavor, which is what I thought it would be. I yeah, it would have been neat if they'd thrown peppermint in there. Yeah. Oh, why didn't they? Or eggnog or something like that. Uh, yeah, I thought that they would give you a new flavor and they yeah, get Yeah, that's just the polar so, punch. Yeah. Well, I think this was fun. It, it's it, a good bag. The only one I really didn't like was the gingerbread, and it's not that I didn't like it. It was just, wasn't something I would want to eat. It was just strong ginger, and if you don't like really, we like lighter gingerbread. Yeah. If you don't like really strong gingerbread, you wouldn't like this. Right. Uh, well, I'm going to take a picture. You might find it gross, but it is <laughs> my- Like yeah. previously chewed gum. Yeah, yeah, it's good. my little cemetery of the, you know the but you can uh, see the colors too. and stuff really you good. can see the colors and they're not all spitty either so. no they're not the colors are really really pretty on these and so thank you very much to mark and heidi we appreciate this uh we still have a whole oh, yeah, lot i mean there are a ton of suckers here uh that i can give to gavin and he will really enjoy so thank you very much i hope everyone else enjoyed the video and thanks for watching